Warner's Quick Tips to a Perfect Fit. First, measure your band size. Stand in front of a mirror wearing a lightly padded bra. Make a snug measurement around your rib cage, placing measuring tape directly under your bust. The tape should be parallel to the floor and fit snugly, but not dig into the skin. Next, we'll calculate your band size. If your rib cage measurement is an odd number, add three inches to find your true band size. If it's an even number, add two inches. For example, if your rib cage measurement is 33 inches, an odd number, add three inches and you'll discover your true band size is a 36. If your rib cage measurement is 34 inches, an even number, add two inches, which also equals a 36 inch band size. Now we'll measure your bust size. Wrap the measuring tape around your back and join the tape at the front over the fullest part of your bust. Pull the measuring tape tight enough that it is parallel to the floor, but not digging into the skin. At this point, we can determine your overall bra size. Subtract your band size measurement from your bust size measurement. For example, if your bust size is 39 inches and your band size is 36 inches, your number would be three. Take the number from that calculation and refer to the sizing chart shown here. As you can see, every inch difference between your band size and bust size represents a cup size. For example, one inch equals an A cup, two inches equals a B cup, 3 inches equals a C cup, and so on. In our calculation example, the answer was 3 inches. So the correct cup size is C, making our overall bra size 36C. Always remember that measuring is only a starting point and not an exact science. Breast shape and body type will also impact the perfect size. Step 4. Now we'll perfect your fit. Checkpoint 1. The band. The band should provide the bra's support, not the straps. The band and cups should support the bra, even when the straps are off the shoulder. Ensure that the band fits snugly when hooked on the loosest hook. You should be able to easily slide two fingers underneath the back of the band. The band should sit perfectly horizontal on the same level as the bottom of the cups. If the back band is riding up, you need a different size. Checkpoint 2. The straps. The strap's purpose is to assist in keeping the bra in place, not for support. If adjusted properly, the strap should not dig in or slide off of your shoulders. You should be able to easily slide one finger underneath each strap. Checkpoint 3. The cups. The cups should contain your breasts comfortably and not allow overflow, wrinkling, or gaping on the top or sides of the cup. The bra cup should anchor comfortably underneath the breasts. Finding your perfect fit may take some effort, but you'll be surprised how much it can brighten your day. Happy fitting!